guys the face of music. I see it right now. That's why I'm such a hardcore fan. I've been following them since Carnival Miami 2017. Proud fan. Can't wait to grow up with you guys. Woo! Love the run. Hi everyone, we're back with another episode of Dinner with the Remy's. We're the Remy's and we're having dinner with Isaac tonight. Tonight's episode is brought to you by Magic 13 Brewery. Yes, sir. Cheers. Cheers. It's going to be a good one. Yeah. Guys, guys. So I don't know about y'all, but I am ready to eat. Yep, most definitely. Justin, what we got? So we got the Wagyu burger right here. Ooh. And we got the steak fries. Ooh. And we also got the sausage links right here. Mm -hmm. we got Ooh. the spinach dip. Yeah. And we got the pork belly right here. Well, I'm going to yeah. tap into these. I'm going to jump into these fries, most oh, definitely. I got to jump God. into these fries. You know what? Me too. I'm, I'm tapping into the spinach dip. Yes. Whoa. So tonight. We're chilling with Isaac. Yeah. Isaac, how you doing, my man? Man, I'm doing fantastic, honestly. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just grateful to be here, really. it's uh, It's been a fun journey, but it's mm -hmm. funny. It's funny. I'm glad to be here. I really am. Heck yeah, man. It, after not having seen you all these years, man, yeah, what have you been up to? Yeah, man. Oh, dude, it's crazy. It's been up and down recently. It really has. Like, there was a part mm -hmm. where I wanted to try and mix martial arts. That was definitely something I was interested in, mm -hmm. but... With time, you know, you realize that there's other things that you, you'd be better at, things that, that have your calling, things that you just, you're destined for. So that's really what it was. It was just a fine, uh, it was a journey of self-discovery. That's really what it was, a journey of self-discovery. So what do you think you're doing now? Honestly, I like to think that I'm doing okay. I like to think that I'm, that so far I'm keeping my head above water, you know, just trying my best to just keep on keeping on. That's really what it is. So if I'm not mistaken, a Wagyu burger, they take care of them cows. <laughs> what do you mean by take care? <laughs> what do you mean by take care? <laughs> they take care. They play the good music. <laughs> they, 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 they feed they them the, the best. They play the in the background? They have yeah. Remy's. Yeah. Yeah. The Remy's in the light. A little massage, <laughs> too. <laughs> just to get you they, they massage these cows. Exactly. What do you mean to tell me they massage the cows? They massage the cows. <laughs> yeah. They feed them the best a, grass. I need a fact check on this. Wagyu is very expensive. Ask anybody. Absolutely. Yo, you can feel it belly, on the tongue. This pork belly is winning. Is it? Oh, is right? it? Let me try it's this. Winning. You guys gotta try it. I'm trying it right now. I'm gonna jump in you there. You guys gotta sure. jump yeah, in. Yeah, yeah. Jump oh in my right God, now. God, look at that. Right. You see now. that? Mm. Oh! Crispy, golden, beautiful. Absolutely. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, waffle one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yo, so yeah. Isaac, man. Yeah. Who's over there looking at the video? From back in the day when we were at TM Poets. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and we, we had this little thing going on. But just a quick question. What was your thoughts back then and now? So back then, for sure, in the moment, it was the first time I ever really felt like music really like had to make me move. You feel me? Like when I was in that TM Poets experience, like it was just it was fun. You know what I mean? It was just that's exactly what music should be. Mm -hmm. Absolutely something that just like take you away, make you feel something. And that's absolutely what happened for me in TM Poets. I just, I got caught up in it, the music, all of it, the energy, the performance, all of it, I loved. And because of that, I really like, I was caught up in it. I loved it, absolutely. And now, to see you guys still making music, still pushing, I love it, I absolutely love it. I love to see it. And, and to know that we shared a very, very precious moment together, I really, it really means a lot to me. Because in that moment, it was it was more than an, it was more than just music. It was it was an emotion. It was a feeling. It was passion. And I, I was I was just grateful to be in the room. It really was. Well, that Yo, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> We're happy to have you in the room. I think. That's the first time I ever yeah. heard somebody break down like that, man. Yo, ah. yo, thank you so much, man. Yeah, That's what man. I want my fans to feel all the time. Y'all motherfuckers made a move for yeah. sure. It was fire. It was fire. Uh, I yeah. loved it. Amazing. Now I'm trying to get into this wagyu. That wagyu is not a bad idea. I'm trying to get oh. into this. Mm -mm. Now, oh, look these like fries a, are fire. Look like I need a uh, bigger knife or something. I don't think I'm gonna be able to cut. This so one. Isaac, you're a fighter, right? Yeah, I was. Yeah. I was. You was? I, I I dabbled. I dabbled, but I don't think I was ever a fighter. I think I was just more of a. I went to the gym. I tried to do it, but I never had an official fight, so I can't really call myself a fighter. Right. Yeah, I get you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but but from what you learned. 
right? Right, okay. What would you say was the most complicated move to do for you? Ooh, that's a really good point. Just showing up. Mm. Just showing up was the most complicated move for me. It really was. Because wow. the funny thing is, it's, this, it's a mental battle every single day. It really wow. is just just getting just getting to the gym is the biggest hurdle. That's fifty percent of the of, of, of the of the hard fight is just being that. disciplined, being focused, just staying in it. You know, it's, it's the consistency that really was for me at least the hardest part. Was especially when you don't feel good, you're hurting. You know, like just whatever it is that day, maybe you just don't want to show up, but it, it's it's coming through when you have to. You know what I mean? So that's really that really was for me the, the hardest part. You got a good head on your shoulder. Man. I think a lot of people can learn from that. Yeah, you got a good you think head so? on your shoulder, bro. Yeah. I appreciate that. You get man. deep with all that advice. You, you got a good head on your shoulders, man. As a young man, really I, good. I appreciate that, man. Thank you so much. I do, I do, and that, that's, that's absolutely what it is. It's just keep on keeping on. That's all it comes yeah, keep down on, to. Keeping on. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm sorry, bro. You don't just. You yep. just I, don't know. <laughs> I am so, bro. I don't know what's going on Dissecting with me right now. Dissecting this sausage. <laughs> I'm sorry, is that purple? Is that purple? That's the only It looks purple. It, no, yeah. that's blood. It looks purple. That's a blood sausage. That's blood sausage. Oh, they done brought me the knife. Mm. We got a knife. Hey! hey. Now we can make it happen. Hey, Justin, how about you? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Cut that up and forward real quick. There you go. Give us a good forward at. Mm. Yo, I actually don't mind having one of these steaks. Too. Man, that's not nice. That's nice. 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 absolutely should try that steak. That steak is Ooh, too amazing. Oh, my hands ain't there. My hands ain't there. But the garlic bread? My hands ain't there. What you think? Oh, good? Let's, yo, the garlic let's all bread, eat the garlic bread, bread at the same time. I already ate mine, right. bro. Yeah, damn. How dare you? This damn bread for me. Jumping into this wagyu. Okay. I gotta try ah. me a nice wagyu burger. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's jump in. I appreciate my uh, my 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 backroom crew and everybody back there. Let's give a hand for the backroom crew. Yeah, yeah man. Let's make, sure, let's make sure we know that for they are sure. here with us always. We couldn't do it without you guys. We appreciate everything that you guys do. Yeah, mm-hmm. let's all try the burger at the same time. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay. Oh, look at it. It I looks got my, beautiful. Chris, you if you yeah, guys can I got Chris. See, it, Chris, that's you. Right, it looks you. so good. All right, here we go. Yeah, here we go. All right, you guys ready? Three, two, two, two one. Ah. Mm. Mm. See that meat? Oh my God. <laughs> you don't need to bite in it. It yep. just goes right through it. This That's was, all that massage. This was all That's done. all that massage. <laughs> this is done the wellest. That's all that wow. massage they did to the meat. They did oh my god! It's just That's so really good. good. It's so soft. It just falls off like it's oh. I need to get him on the commercial, bro. Absolutely. <laughs> hey, get him on the Magic commercial. Thirteen. Magic Thirteen. Yeah. One spot with everything that you might need. Great food, great people, great music. Come out for sure. Yep. Y'all need to get him as a sponsor. I just did. <laughs> Good boy, speaking. Yo, Avery, I gotta tell you, man, the Remy's have one of the best live performances I've ever seen. So I gotta ask you, man. What is it about you guys that when you come together and play together, it's just so magical? I think it's the years of us playing all together for so mm. long. You know, a lot of us knew each other in middle school. Then we went to high school and we would play together just for school, you know, jazz band, stuff like that. Absolutely, and then, yeah. Next thing you know, you know, we would, it's, we were gigging mm-hmm. and show after show after show we didn't know you know that it'll be like this absolutely yeah, at the yeah. time but it was I guess you know we were blessed in a way to know to just have the you know Chris and Justin and, mm-hmm. and Oscar and the other Chris and I, I don't know it just happened for us the, the way it happened and we were just meant for this it's, it's funny how things fall together in the yeah. weird way is just you guys found each other, right? And, and, yeah. and, and the, the craziness of it all, you guys found each other and created a bond together. And mm-hmm. definitely when you guys play, I can feel you guys playing off of each other's energies and just really giving it all to the performance. So I can, I can definitely tell you I appreciate that as, as a viewer, as somebody that enjoys it, enjoys the music, I can tell you that it's, it's a vibe for sure. Justin, yes, homie, yes, listen. I gotta know, what is your favorite Remy song of yours to play live? Mm. That's a good question. It's a good I question. Know this. 
We don't play it anymore. Really? Yeah. What? Yeah, we played. Holy very, shit! Very what long happened? Time. I don't know what happened. <laughs> wow. Uh, the name was. Um, uh, it's called Hesitate. Hesitate. Ooh, that, I haven't played that in a very long time. Oh, the reason why I like that song is because it's very uh, difficult for me to play. Okay. Uh, it was very difficult for me to record it too as well. I do it a lot of times. And um, I just like the transitions and the turns in that song. It's very like what you said earlier, you, you know, you feel everything. Basically mm. that song is the, well, I'm not going to say the only song, but it's in my top three songs that I've created with the Remy's. That's one of the songs that I feel the most, that I don't I feel, feel you. anymore because, you know, we don't, we don't play it. We Absolutely. Don't play. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but I would love to play that song again one day. I feel you. How, how did that affect you? Like, how did that, like, you know, you put in so much time. Like, I just, I wonder, from your perspective. Hey, from my perspective, uh, just putting in time um, through that whole EP process, it was very um, fun for me because I've been playing for so long, and this is the only thing that I'm really, really good at. Yeah. In my opinion, right now, I'm only 27, but, you know, I might be later down the line good at something else. But music has always been, you know, my my uh, freedom, my peace, and my provider as well. Absolutely, and, yeah. And, you know, I was blessed with this gift. And as older as I get, you know, I see what I can, you know, get from it and how I can, you know, make it uh, better for myself. But that whole process of Hesitate and doing that whole EP, it, it was a very fun time. So, Chris, how long have you been a musician? How did you get to this point in your career when you're writing EPs, coming out with writing camps, doing dinner with the Remy's? How did it all come together? So, I started playing the drums when I was nine years old. Um, and the very first time that I even sat on a drum set, I played a straight beat. It just Ooh. happened. It went pat, pat, and I just had it without yeah, even like practicing good. or knowing anything about drums. And at that moment I realized, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and at that moment I realized, oh, this is what I love to do, you know? Yeah. And, um, but I was also blessed that my dad is a musician as well. So he used to be a bassist back in his band. Okay, okay. And since I was little, you know, I would always see him, you know, making music and playing the bass and playing the guitar. And um, prior to playing the drums, I wasn't actually interested in being a musician, but now that I am a musician, I've just been blessed that he's been able to support and give us like, and give me that support of like, of like, I know how it is being a musician. Mm. So let me give you some pointers, let me give you some tricks, this and that. And I think with his help and with just dedication and practice every day, taking classes, going on YouTube, YouTube University. YouTube yeah, University. Um, yep. With all that combined together, that's, that's um, where I got to where I'm at. Wow, that's I a really say. good story, man. I really appreciate that. And um, yeah, and it's always a learning thing. Like, like, I still don't feel like I'm at the level where I need to be. And mm -hmm. I feel like it'll always feel that way. But that's just my way of like. But that's what to get keeps better. you pushing. That's yeah. what keeps you trying. That's what keeps you trying to learn and grow and really develop in it. It's just that that feeling of of there's there is still room to do more. Absolutely. Hundred percent. For sure. 100%. We got a special guest in the building by the name of Isaac. We got a brand new song. This song is called Naked. We hope you guys enjoy it. Come on. Say, what would it take for the world to stop falling apart? It was a shame the way they left us in the dark. I'm in the car and I got my right foot on the gas I don't know where I'm going but I know I'm going fast Somehow I end up next to you Gucci bird saying all for you Say you don't drink but I know you do Your last love it just wasn't true At night we get naked Floating on a spaceship 
you're made of got it You like to feel it, well embrace it Life's not guaranteed, it's COVID-19 Dinner with the Remy's episode five. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you, Isaac. <laughs>